Television CK, YouTube, Musha, Musco Slice, and I yes, I did it. YouTube, Musha, Musco Slice, Musco Slice, and you what you are logo. I'm going to watch again, get it. Mofia, Obalogo. what's up guys welcome to television ck so if you are new to this channel please be sure to subscribe and hit the notifications button uh, so that every time we post a new video you'll be updated and if you are a revisiting subscriber thank you so much for coming back we appreciate you a lot so sad news today actress ikiapin polo has been sentenced to 90 days in prison by the accra circuit court over naked pictures with her son so this conviction comes after she posted a naked picture of herself with her son on Instagram celebrating her seventh birthday. Ghanaians gave her a lot of backlash after the pictures came out. People were saying it was, you know, indecent exposure and a lot of people had a lot to say about it. However, Ikuya Pimpolo, following the backlash after she posted the picture, came out to apologize to Ghanaians, you know, according to where she didn't know, blah, blah, blah. She apologized to Ghanaians. So fast forward, a couple of months later, the case was in court and Ikuya Pimpolo initially pleaded not guilty to the charges you know brought against her but later upon advice by her very qualified lawyers Ikea Pimpolo pleaded guilty to three charges that were brought against her a lot of Ghanaians jumped to Ikea Pimpolo's defense you know with the hashtag free Ikea Pimpolo trending on Twitter all through her court case in fact Ghanaian rapper Sa Akodia reacted to Ikea Pimpolo's convicting saga um which became a dialogue on social media. Sir Akodye added his voice to the many social media users who were raged over what they described as injustice, citing several reasons to support their claims following the news that Rosemond Brown, aka Ikuya Pimpolo, had been convicted and on the verge of being sentenced to prison over public nudity. Before her sentencing, Ikuya Pimpolo was said to have to undergo pregnancy tests to determine her situation or condition for the sentencing. The pregnancy test came back negative and Ikea Pimpolo is currently going to jail. Sarkodia added his voice to, you know, the ongoing saga yesterday where he apologized on the behalf of the, you know, controversial video vixen and pleaded that the law pardons her on the idea that it's just a little harsh to separate a toddler from the mom simply because of images taken. In a tweet, Sarkodia wrote, I think it is a touch harsh to separate a toddler from the mom simply because of images taken. We would want to plead with the law to pardon our sister. Hashtag free Ikuya Pimpolo. So yes, hashtag free Ikuya Pimpolo was trending um, on Twitter as of yesterday and even today. Sentencing has come out now that Ikuya Pimpolo's pregnancy test came out negative by the Accra Circuit Court and Ikuya Pimpolo is here to, say, uh, to serve 90 days in prison, which is an equivalent of three months. So handing her judgment, Christina Khan expressed discontent with the alarming rate with which nudity has become a thing in the country's social media space. She said it is important that the court take serious sanctions for the message to go down with everyone how wrong it is to do that on social media the judge also added that the actress is being punished to serve as a disincentive to others 
on Wednesday, the actress uh, who was also who was remanded into custody underwent a pregnancy test before sentencing. The actress was facing charges of publication of obscene materials, engaging in domestic violence, namely conduct that in any way undermines another person's privacy or integrity, and engaging in domestic violence, namely conduct that in any way distracts or is likely to uh, detract from another person's dignity and worth as a human being. According to the prosecution, on June 30th, 2020, Rosemont Brown celebrated her son's, her son's seventh birthday by taking nude pictures together with her son, who was also half naked. She posted a picture on her Instagram page and the picture um, went viral on social media. The pictures attracted comments, you know, adding that the behavior of Equiapin Polo was likely to detract from the dignity of her seven-year-old son, amongst others. The complainant in the case was Bryce Appiah, the director of Child's Rights International Ghana. The child's rights activist petitioned the police after the photo went viral on social media and the matter was referred to the Domestic Violence and Victim Support Unit, DOVSU. Now, Ekiapin Polo's lawyers say they plan to appeal the sentence. So yes, Ekiapin Polo is to spend uh, three months in jail uh, following, you know, the pictures that she posted on social media showing her son's, you know, half naked body and her, you know, total naked body. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. Do you think the law is being too harsh on Ekiapin Polo, you know, using her as a scapegoat to deter other social media users from doing same? Do you think it's too harsh that one person will do it and she will be used as a Do you think she should have been pardoned? Or do you think that it serves her right? I mean, her sentencing and the crime she committed, you know, goes hand in hand. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below. And like I said before, if you have not yet subscribed to Television CK, I don't know what you are waiting for. Please subscribe and hit the notifications button so that every single time we post any new videos, you will be one of the first people to know so you don't miss a thing. Thank you so much for watching. And so we meet again in the next video. Bye. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> Television CK, YouTube, Musha, Musko Strive, and I is added here. YouTube, Musha, Musko Cross Rise, Musko Rise, and you feel what you are logo. I'm going to machine again, get it. Mofia, oh, my logo.